Today, a group of House Democrats, including two Florida freshman congresswomen, got to look inside. The federal shelter, which reopened last year, currently houses more undocumented, unaccompanied young people than any other facility in the country, about 1,600 children, with plans to add even more. I did not see criminals. I did not see gang members. I saw kids who have hope. We need to get these children to family members much more quickly. And Congress will have the opportunity, particularly the House of Representatives, to look at what's holding up the process. Migrant children who illegally cross into the U.S. must be sent to a government shelter where they stay until they can be re reunited with relatives while awaiting court hearings. The Trump administration reportedly is working on new regulations that it says would terminate and replace that rule. Live in studio, Ron Burke, WPBF 25 News.